Hi everybody, Slim here today, and we're going to be talking about the iPhone 8 leaks that just came out. You know how it is, every year we get a new iPhone and we stand in a little line by an Apple store to get one of the newest iPhones that comes out. And when I say little line, I mean little line. Look at the picture how small it is. Jobs introduced us to the iPhone in 2007, the 2G. Are you 2G? You never had a 1. But, okay. Who cares? That means all the numbers are wrong nowadays. We don't, we're not going to the iPhone 8, we're going to be back to the iPhone 7. But never mind. The iPhone 2G was called 2G for the mobile internet provider that we had back then. That was either Edge or GSM. But later on, we had a better version that came out. It was the 3G for the 3G mobile internet network that we had back then. The thing is, with the earlier iPhones, the 2G had only 4 to 8 gigabyte, and later with the 3G we had 8, 16, 32, and then later the 3GS had a little bit more. But a lot has changed since then. The displays have got bigger and the phones have got thinner. From the 6 to the 7 point have changed is we lost the headphone plug. And the 7 is now, as they say, waterproof. As you can see here on the different iPhones, on sizes and everything, but the thing is from the 6th to the 7th, the body hasn't changed. As you can see here, there's even the iPhone 8, how it should maybe look like, but like I said, none of this have been, has been confirmed or anything. These are just leaks that I found different sites on the internet. What I will do is put this in the description that you can read it yourself and enjoy it. If you, you'll see something that I missed, just put it in the description at the bottom. And I would be glad to hear what you think. Now let's get to the leaks. A lot of sites say it's going to be three iPhones that are coming out. The 7S, the 7 Plus, and the 8. How it looks like the iPhone 8 won't be called the iPhone 8, it'll be just called the iPhone Edition. Because of the 10 year anniversary. Like I said, we'll find that out in September 2017. Okay, now let's go to the iPhone 8. Now it looks like, like I said before, it's going to be either the iPhone 8 or the Apple iPhone edition because of the 10th year anniversary. What it looks like what it's going to have on it is an edge to edge slightly curved OLED display. Touch screen of course. A faster A11 processor. A glass body. Maybe it will have metal on the back. Like I said, this is not 100% confirmed. These are just leaks. A camera and touch ID integrated in display. No home button. I'm a guy, I like a home button because just in case something happens, you can reset it through the different button combinations, as you know, as Apple user, maybe yourself. Um, a wireless charger and a dual camera setup. Like I said, I rather have a cable as a um, wireless charger because I take my iPhone a lot with, charge it at work or whatever. And uh, like I see here, a wireless charger is a little bit bigger. But like I said, nothing's confirmed. We'll see when it comes out. There's some things I read over the internet. At the bottom of the description, I'll put the sites on that you can read it yourself. I hope you liked the video. If you did, put a thumbs up, comment, tell me what you think, and subscribe. Okay, everybody. Till then, and. Uh, Let's wait till the iPhone 8 comes out in September. And little thing, when it does come out in September, that's, let's all just wait in the little, little line, grab the iPhone, hope that it doesn't fall out of the box, it will be on YouTube the biggest fields for this year, and or on international TV. For all that, till then, have a good one and see ya.